eight finalists are waiting backstage. But before we bring them out, let's take a look at how they settled into their new home. Arriving at the house, they only had one thought on their minds. Food. Oh, what's that about? Oh, this is cool. Lock it in the flat. Down in the cargo. Thank golly for that. I'm absolutely stunned. This house is amazing. Two excellent thumbs up. Well, watching sunsets is great, but not nearly as great as watching who from the first group was voted through to the top ten. Second group of eight, we're about to bring them out onto the stage and they're going to sing for you. But right now, if you come with me, here they all are backstage. Hello, guys. Hi. How are we all? We're all looking a little bit anxious. I think we should get started. Should we get into it? Sure. So now, we have our youngest performer this evening. Can you believe it? Only 16 years old, but he's old beyond, beyond his years. I'm talking about Rick. Good to see you, Rick. How are you? I'm good, Tom. How are you? Now, now the one thing that comes across with you, Rick, you're very confident. Where does that come from? Uh, that comes from my family. They just keep supporting me and pumping me up. And, you know, mum, dad, great, brother, great. You know, they just keep telling me, be yourself. What are you singing for us tonight, Rick? I'm singing This Love by Maroon 5, Tom. Great song. Take it away, Rick. Good luck. Thanks, Rick. The idol experience has been great so far. It's just uh, amazing. Makeup was fine. Then they went onto my hair. They pull, pull out these two irons and they pull my hair and start start ironing my hair. Ow! Whoa! Starts crackling and and I'm going. I don't have hair at the end of this, guys. It's not my fault. Oops. I love being on stage. This is what I want to do with my life. I love the love that I get from the audience. I think I've got the dream. I think it's the dream that's pulling me through. Into every interview because I know. You love the love. You're, uh, you, you know, you're a real natural on the stage. You're such a pop kid too. That's a great song for you. I just feel like it's all a bit nice. It's something that you've really got to watch because we need edge. We need some edge to happen here. We need a point of difference. And too much nice equals bland. So just watch that. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you need to dirty up a bit, mate. Really, you know, and it's. Uh... I was kind of missing the boy band stuff with you because that's what it felt like. I needed another two or three other cuties behind you, you know, showing it off. Uh, I mean, you can sing and you look good. You know? 
Didn't do much. Wow. Okay. It was a good song choice. That's a passionate rock song by Maroon 5. It did take shades of cabaret. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't as bad as what they said it was. I actually quite liked it. I thought you're good. You can make a great career out of this. Well done. <laughs> Take a seat, take a seat. Well, Jackie said you're a little bit too nice. Is there a bad boy hiding under there somewhere? Oh, you might find out. You might find out. Perhaps if you go... Perhaps if, 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 I, if I come back for top ten. Yeah, perhaps. I guess we're relying on New Zealand to vote not only for Rick, but for all of your favourites. I'll be giving you the numbers you need a little bit later on. We're going to return right after this with the lovely Lissell. She's coming up next on New Zealand Idol.